So, if I have this uh, control position, I can take this arm, as we just kind of talked about for that Kimura setup, getting it at his wrist and starting to work my elbow down to the ground, right? So, in this instance, he knows that I'm going to probably be going for that Kimura at this point. Um, so what he might do is he might try to defend that by coming up and kind of hooking my head here. So I've got two options here, right? I pinch, I step around, and I go for this armbar. Or I can take at his elbow on the inside here. Maybe I didn't get this grip very well, right? Maybe he didn't go up high enough. Maybe he's on my shoulder. So I'm going to take and I'm bring his elbow down into his chest. And I'm going to keep some weight on that as I start to pull him onto his side, step around, whoop, and here. And I can go for that arm bar. So, I'm here. Maybe I go ahead and lift it up his head and put it up on my thigh so I've got kind of more of this crossbody position. I'm going to start driving this down to the ground, but he knows that I'm going for that Kimura, so he starts to bring it up. And maybe he's pushing on my head. Maybe there's some other reason why I can't go for that cutting arm bar. Maybe he's in too deep. I don't know. So I'm going to grab his bicep and I'm going to take my elbow and I'm going to drive it down. So my elbow might end up on the other side of his body. It might end up right on his chest. But what I want is I want to have kind of that bend in his arm with his um, and kind of sucking into his chest so he can't get that arm back. And I'm grabbing, you know, preferably kind of at the bicep area, um, kind of right in the bend, right? So I get that, I'm going to pull him onto his side, so I back up a little bit so that I have room to pull him out on his side. If, I, if I'm staying glued to him and I start put, pulling him up, he's going to run into my legs, right? So I might you know, bring both my legs back, pull him into the, onto his side, get my knee into that same position as with the far side arm bar, and then just finish it exactly what, like we did that far side arm bar. Alright? Now, maybe I'm into this position, and maybe he's doing a really good job of kind of uh, hiding that arm away so I can't really, I don't really have a hole on this side to start to get um, that first arm bar. So I could come over and then suck down, right? And start going for that same arm bar if from the knee ride. Um, so it's just another way of, of gripping that and getting that arm bar from a different position. Okay, so that's what I wanted to cover. Let's go ahead and move on to the uh, mounts. So.